Review of the Nerf Strife. Your, this is the orange one, but basically all the Nerf Strife will be the same, so yeah. The Nerf Strife is a flywheel. With, uh, no, not. Yeah, a flywheel, semi automatic. Which means it has. Which means you don't need to prime it anywhere, you just hold the ref trigger and then PQ. So, Strife is a pistol primary sort of thing. This one's blue. It's been painted here, don't worry about that. Can't really see the painted it anyways. Yeah, sort of here, but whatever. Ignore that. It does come with a six round magazine. Clear six round mag. This is clear. This is opaque. So you can sort of see your darts. But it's insufficient for most uses. Which is what and it's compatible with other bigger magazines like this 18 run stick mag. Anyways, so at starting up at the front, you have an in-strike um, barrel attachment, to, which accepts any in-strike barrels. This is just a spectre barrel. Coming on back, we have front sling, followed by an iron sight. Down here, we have a bottom tactical rail for a bipod. Odd place because there's a mag wheel right behind it. It also conveniently acts as a left hand thing unless you're dual wielding. Behind, behind the bottom tactical rail is the magazine well, which you know holds any instruct magazines. It's obvious. And down here is the magazine. This is a magazine, six round mag, not a clip. Hasbro. Yet. And. Yeah, it's a mag world. Except any instruct mags like I showed you. 18 round stick mag. Nah, where's the camera? It says 18 round. says 18 over there. It fits. Above that is the access door, being a magazine fed blaster. Obviously, it has an access door. To get to that, you just. Get this. Mine might be a little bit weak. Yours. You might need to, um, a little notch over here, you'll be able to see it right here, right here, you can, you can just get your finger in there and open it, and pry it open, or with mine, it might be weak, you can just do this and just pull up, mine might be very weak, in there, so, to clear it in jams or malfunctions, and, Strangely, you can feel the flywheels, which are just wheels that fling the dart out of your blaster. This barrel. And behind that, a top tactical rail. Hooray! And then, down to the trigger. And this top trigger is the primary trigger you pull to fire a dart. And below that is the ref trigger. And this is a modified strike, slightly modified. So that's louder than a normal strike than you'll get. But you hold that down for a few seconds before you shoot, or else you're gonna jam your thing. Oh wait, can wait. Norm, unless you modify it, you can't jam your thing because there's a lock. And if you get the blue strike, you need a full ma a full magazine, or else it won't even shoot, won't even rev. The trigger itself, it's nice. Ergonomic, though this is kind of annoying, but you know, you can get used to it because you need that. And in front, you might not see it because it's all orange. This, this is a button. So when you pull, put a magazine in, you can't take it out normally. Every nerfer knows that. If you're not a nerfer, that's a fact. Can't pull it that now. Usually magazines are, well, releases are either here or here, or both. This one's in the middle, so um, right and lefties can use it equally. Although I'd say it's probably, actually probably for both. And this, this is, and back here is a stock attachment point. It, it will fit most stocks, but... It just won't look as good because it's an even top view. This side and this side are uneven. <coughs> <Sorry. coughs> 
whoops, I'm a little bit sick. Anyways, this side is a little bit more uneven because this is the battery tray. It runs on, being a flywheel, it needs batteries. It runs on four AA batteries. And more nerfing, strife, blah, blah, blah. And also, I'm pretty sure it's also um, fatter here because the flywheel's in there. The flywheels. Little wheels that, you know, rifle the dark out. Anyways, to use it, you load it up, or you load up a magazine, put anything on, you don't need to, but it's better to use it, unless you want to use it as a pistol, because it can. Six or... Just, actually, get a strike with... Just do that, put it in a holster, or a sling, when you, when you need, like, when your primary jams, take this out, and you can start shooting. A 35 round drum would be better, but I don't have that, so whatever. Now let's get to the firing demo. Oh, hit! I think that was a brown. That was a green. That was a green, I think, and I'm empty. 